Hi, it's Dr. Joni Liu. And today I want to ask you this question, how bad do you want something? Yesterday I talked about how I got to speak at Harvard for a second time and that was amazing. But I want to tell you about how I actually got to speak at Harvard the very first time. As I said, you know, I was given an opportunity to speak at Harvard clubs and I said yes to it and then in that very same week two more requests for me to speak came up at the same time and one of them was to speak at Harvard Medical School and so I had to apply okay <laughs> so I had to apply for it and it had to go through uh, a committee to for approval and of course it was going to take weeks and so while I'm waiting I'm trying not to have contradictory thoughts about about getting into being accepted to be a speaker at Harvard and all I did was I imagined what it would be like you know to be speaking at Harvard I imagined how I would feel if I would when I was accepted you know because there was no if I was going to be accepted as a speaker and then it happened you know within a few weeks I was given the great news that um, that I was accepted and you know I had to do things I'd never done before like <laughs> write an abstract about what this talk was going to be about so I had to be prepared I had to get on it right away so there were a number of things that were asked of me that I'd never done before but I went and did it anyways and then on the very last day of the conference um, after I had spoken it was revealed to us that there were over 600 uh, applications to speak at Harvard and only 285 applicants were accepted and so I was one of those 285 people it was amazing so less than half of us were accepted so it's really important for you you know when you really really want something that you actually keep thinking about the fact that you have it okay that it's happened that you've been accepted and that you're doing it and then you do all the uh, everything that's been asked for you in order to get in there because it was kind of amazing uh, the person who was supposed to be who was scheduled after me didn't show up can you imagine being invited to Harvard and then you don't show up Wow so think about that. Are you going to show up when the thing that you want the most turns up? Okay, you have to show up too. So that's the reason why, you know, I accepted the second uh, invitation to speak at Harvard too because I had asked for it and when it did show up, then I had to show up too. So please, you know, comment, share this video, you know, send it out to create inspiration and encouragement to anybody that you know or even for yourself who needs that encouragement knowing that if you just hold on to that image of you doing exactly what it is that you want then you're going to have it okay so talk to you next time bye